Hello everyone, my name is Madeline Hoyos Edwards. I am a Cuban American. I came to this country from Cuba during the revolution when I was around six years old. And even though my parents did a great job keeping that Cuban spirit in me, I'm also very much an American. But one thing that they have preserved in me is the love of our Cuban coffee and how our culture is built around it. Through this wonderful object called a cafetera. And this is my special object that I will tell a quick story about. This cafetera, which is not made in Cuba, is an Italian cafetera or coffee maker, which is over 80 years old in the 1930s in Italy. It was designed and called a mocha. I suppose that's where the word mocha comes from. Anyway, Cubans love coffee and they built their culture around it. And that is the cafetera or coffee maker that they used in Cuba. And it is used till this day in every Cuban household here in America because we love our coffee and we celebrate life through it. We drink it in these tiny little coffee cups. We call it a cafecito because it's very strong. So you have to have just a little shot. This is enough, a little cafecito shot. And we, we just love our little coffee shots. We have them throughout the day, not just in the morning. Anytime somebody comes over to visit, we make cafecito. It's very sweet. It's a wonderful pick-me-up. And it's a great way to enjoy family and friends. And it is at the heart of our Cuban culture. So this is my special object, the Cuban coffee maker. And I'm telling you my story through a cafecito shot. Anyway, it's a pleasure to be part of this, and I hope you like my video and enjoy a little bit of history for Cuban Americans everywhere and our wonderful love of coffee. Bye.